yes, we are just going to dive straight in and I'm going to show you how you can remove um, framer badges from your website. And as you can see, this is a free website in Framer. So it's not paid. I'm not on a paid plan. But over here, you will notice that the Framer badge isn't showing. And that's why I created this video because you are going to get access to the source code, which will easily integrate into this free website. And of course, this is Phoenix Designs and you're welcome to my YouTube channel. And this is my portfolio. I'll leave the link in the description below for you to go check it out. So let's dive right in. I have opened up a, um, a new framer template web design. This is a portfolio and credits to the designer. And so I would simply publish this so that we can see how it looks like, or I can just open it. And this is the website. Pretty impressive, isn't it? Edits content icon and this made in framer badge so we don't really like that okay we don't want to see that and sometimes it can make our beautiful design look unprofessional so here's one thing i did i first of all went to inspect to check out the source code for this icon and as you can see if we trace the tag we would see that um this icon is under this button and it's under this div and the name of this div, that's the ID, is Framer Editor Bar Container. So we know that this div is called Framer Editor Bar. And if we check also in Made in Framer, this badge, if we trace it up, if we trace it up, we'll see that this div is also called, um, this div ID is Framer Badge Container. So now we know the ID of these two. So what we want to achieve is that this, the display of these two, um, div box, which has an ID, we want their display to be set to none. So we're going to overwrite the code. So I've already done that for you people. And I have the source code over here. So I'm simply going to copy this and let me close this and Right here in Framer, I will go to Settings. Yeah. And under General, I'm going to scroll down till I meet this section. So we're going to paste this custom code we have at the end of the body tag. And then we are just going to save. Now let's hit Publish. Let's hit Update. Okay, so if we open this link, you'll see that the badges are no longer there. So I will leave the link to this source code in the description box below. And don't forget to subscribe. So, do you want to design apps and websites people actually love but don't know where to start? With UX UI design made simple, you'll learn the essentials step by step. From mastering Figma to building real portfolio projects, this course makes design easy, even if you are a complete beginner. Click the link in the description to see the full course outline and all the bonus resources waiting for you. Start your design journey today with UX UI Design Made Simple.